Hello everyone, my name is Peli from the Microsoft Make Code, and today I'm going to show you how to translate our tutorials or documentation. So if you haven't done this already, you need to register as a translator, and this is done through makecode.com slash translate. So go ahead and do that, and then come back to this video. All right, so let's go into the Make Code editor, and this is usually how you use Make Code. And in this video, what we're going to want to do is translate this tutorial. Now, how do we do that? Let's get started. First thing first, you're going to open our documentation outside the editor, and this is done by going to http colonwackwack.makecode.microbit.org slash docs. This will open a rendered version of the editor. Go ahead and navigate to projects, then navigate to tutorials, and now you can find the, you we're finding the page you were looking for, which is smiley button, so this is the one. Go and click on that. And now I'm seeing the page I want to translate. And right now I'm seeing it in English, but uh, I'm going to want to translate that in French. Now to get into, to translate this page, you don't have to go to Crowdin. We're going to do it right here. So let's see how do we do that. Scroll down to the bottom and click on language, this button right here. And this is the language selection dialog. So we use that typically to change the language, but if you scroll down all the way to the bottom, right here, there's a translate this page editor. All right, click on that. And if you're signing with uh, Crowdin, it will reload in this mode. If you see that where you're reloading over and over again, go ahead and read our docs. You might have to disable a feature called same side cookies in your browser. Okay. So now you're basically translating this page on the spot. It's called in context. You can see that we have here a green box around button smiley. And this means that this string has been translated and validated. If you click on this little icon here, you see that um, Sid translated it and I validated it. So you can go down the, the file and find all the green, green, green. And this one is blue. You can see that it has kind of a bluish aspect to it. Um, so we can go and click on that. And we can see that uh, Sid already, oh, and it is already validated. Oh, it's the second one that, there's two sentences here, so go ahead. So this one is also, it is translated, so a translated submitted translation, and I'm a proofreader, I can go and validate it. Appuyez sur le bouton, no, 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 no. Okay, boom. That's it. I've done my work of translation. It takes 24 hours to make it live. And here we can do add translation and so forth. So that was a quick video on how to translate make code from the documentation pages. See you around.